Hey friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and more. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I just wanted to get on here and do a little chit chat and show you guys a couple things. Um, see, I have a little bit of friend mail. And first of all, I want to show you. I came home the other day and there was a package in the mail. And it was for my father-in-law. And he told me he was sending me something and then I would get it around like Tuesday or Wednesday. But I actually got it Monday evening. And I wanted to show you guys. He gifted me this gorgeous pocketbook. That's my K. I don't want to say um, Lois from Life of Lois. She, I'm pretty sure it's Lois that gifted me that. Um, but this is the beautiful purse that he gifted me. And I'll show you some pictures um, at the end also. So, and these are like little keys. I thought this was so cool. There's little keys where you can actually lock it up because you can put, you know, some concealed things in there. <laughs> and um, you can lock it up. So I thought that was really neat. I just thought it's so beautiful. I really love it. And I um, was just so grateful for that um, sweet, kind gift. And um, next I have a beautiful card from our friend Robin over at Robin Sadowski, that's her channel, and I'll link the channels down below. So she, she gifted me this beautiful card that will, of course, go up over there on that wall. That was weird. Um, so it says, uh, especially for you at Easter, we open our eyes a little wider to all the blessings in our lives. And... It says, Happy Easter to you and your family. Praying you have a great holiday. Very happy we met online on YouTube. I'm very happy we did too, Robin. And very thankful for your friendship. It says, Kimmy, wishing you much happiness and a beautiful, meaningful Easter. God bless Robin Sadowski. And she put some cute little bunny stickers and flowers in there. Isn't that beautiful? Little tulips and eggs. And so I will put that up over there. Um... I kind of try to th do the wall so that I have like cards and then like Valentine cards, um, sympathy cards from when we had lost my mother-in-law. Um, and then I've got like fall ones, fall and Halloween. And then now I'm starting like a spring, spring selection there. So, um, but look, she put these adorable stickers in there. Um, this one and then this one and then she knows we all love our tea Tuesday and she puts some uh, turmeric ginger and cinnamon which all three of those are amazing for you so um, it says organic turmeric herbal infusion so thank you so much Robin I definitely appreciate this and we'll be using this for sure um, and then um, this next one is from Sweet Kiki, and her channel is Kathleen Murkovich Robinson. And look at that adorable little basket with the chicks on it. It's so cute. And look at the bunny. I actually saw a bunny the other day. It was over in my neighbor's yard, and it was just sitting there by the bushes. It was so cute. And then um, when we were, the kids and I were walking the other day, um, we saw um, a bunny in the yard also. And I've actually seen one in our in our own backyard, but they don't stay around too long because, you know, Max and Daisy chase them off just like they chase the squirrels up the trees. So <laughs> they're kind of honorary that way, but I guess it's their job, right? So it says, an Easter wish for you. So pretty. Oh, she put some stickers in here too, some Easter stickers. It says, dear Kimmy and family, may all the little joys of springtime be yours. Wanted to spread some Easter cheer, love, and friendship, Kiki. Thank you, Kiki. And that will go, of course, up there as well. And I'll leave that there because I'm going to send them some cards as well. So look how cute these are. These will be fun to put on envelopes for friend mail. And it says, Happy Easter Day. And look at this one. These are so cute. With the little bunny smile and the little chick with the big eyes. That's so cute. So thank you, Robin, and thank you, Kiki. And then I have one thing I want to show you guys real quickly. And um, this is just so neat. My daughter and I were talking about 
the fact that one day we were going for a bike ride and we were like, oh, I wish we could take Daisy. Um, and we have on, on the front of my bicycle, I have a little cup holder. So I can put my bottle of water down in it or I can stick my phone down in it, whatever. But I also wear leggings that have the pockets that I can stick my phone down into. Um, but Bella has on hers a little bag, but it's like a, almost um, looks like a fanny pack that you put on the front of your bicycle and she, can, she too can lay her, her phone down in there or whatever, you know, she wants to put down in there. Um, and she was saying, oh, we could put her in the basket, but it's the bag. It's not safe enough. It's not, you know, and then I said, oh, I wonder if they make like little backpacks for dogs. And so we started looking on Amazon and it was funny because last weekend we had also got, I went and took her and got her groomed. Um, and when we were walking out, when she, uh, Daisy was in there getting groomed, um, we saw um, the bag, the exact bag that I ended up ordering off of um, Amazon. And it was like $69.99 or $79.99 with a crazy, crazy, crazy markup. Um, same bag. And I got it on Amazon for $19.99. So, um, Amazon is definitely one of those good uh, resources to um, check into if you're looking for something and you want to save a little money. Now, not always. Sometimes there is stuff that's expensive, but for the most part that we have found, that's why we order it because we know we're going to have it within two days. Sometimes a little longer now that, you know, the postal's slower and a lot's going on with our world. But... For the most part because we do have amazon prime it's at our house you know in two days so it's great um and you can also ship them out to you know gifts out to family and friends and not have to worry about going to the post office and dealing with boxes and dealing with extra postage and all that you know um it'll just get shipped right to them so that's wonderful too um but i want to show you guys this bag it's called um, Fiandra, Fi, Fiandria, Fiandria, it's Fiandria brand. Okay, and this is what it looks like, and it's got the little mesh zipper here. Show you guys, just unzips. Puppy goes in here. There's a little, um, it's like a um, padded uh, cloth in there. It's um, actually like, it feels like a, kind of like a, um, almost like a little carpet. It has a carpet feeling to it and it's black. And then over here on the sides, we've got pockets if we want to put something down in there. Like um, I have a travel bowl for Daisy and Max. Um, so like if we go anywhere and they travel with us, um, when we pull over to the side of, you know, rest stops or wherever and they use the restroom and then if they're thirsty, we have those little um, travel bags and it's um, sort of like a trying to think of the material it's not like the hard regular bowls that you have in your house it's kind of like a cloth material um so you could put something like that in there or um your phone you know i can stick my phone down in there um and then over on this side there's one as well um, another one a little bit smaller that you can put like your chapstick or whatever you need to put in there you can put your bottle of water in there or your cup um and then over here, let me zip this back up. Up at the top, it's mesh, but you guys also unzip it. They want to stick their little heads through there, especially like if you're backpacking, if you're walking with them. Um, I won't probably won't do it, you know, riding the bicycle. Don't want to chance her trying to be crazy and trying to jump out if she sees a squirrel or a dog or a rabbit. Um, and like I said, this was $19.99. Like, I was, thought that was an excellent deal. And then up here, um, it also has, it's got the little clip. I don't know if you can see it. It has a little clip. You just unclip it, and then you can unzip it as well. They can put their heads in through there. Um, and then it also, like I said, it clips back up for safety, so you don't have to worry. Because Daisy's one that will dig and dig and dig to get to where she wants to go. So she could easily open that, but with that, you don't have to worry about it because it does on both of them. It does have the clips, so you never have to worry. They're not; she's not going to get that open. Um, and I, my daughter stuck her cat in it to see how she liked it, and she kept coming in it. 
but I was a little worried because they like to dig and scratch too with those nails and claws and I did not want her tearing this up before we even got a chance to utilize it, you know. Um, it's got where you can carry it, the little handle. It's got the backpack straps that are adjustable. So if you want to carry it on your back, um, like I said, hiking or walking or when you're bicycling. Um, and she's got plenty of room in here to be comfortable and you also have um, plenty of airway um, at the top both sides sorry guys the top both sides and in the front so you know if you like to um, backpack or hike and you maybe you don't want to leave your fur babies at home that day or you just want to get them out or, you, or they enjoy going out too because my dogs love 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 walking even Max with now with his heart problem, he loves to walk and he will just keep walking. The vet asked me, um, does he get tired and you have to pick him up and carry him? And I was like, oh no, goodness, that would be quite a trek back if we were out walking. And then I had to um, carry him because he weighs 30 pounds. So yeah, <laughs> it would be a workout for sure. But, um, but no, he does great. And we don't overdo it either. You know, we make sure that you can tell he's starting to get tired, you know, we head on back. Um, but yeah, I wanted to share that with you guys and all my friend mail and everything. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Share it out. I think this is a really neat um, product. And um, if you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button and the bell notification. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day, a wonderful rest of your day. It is a beautiful day here in North Carolina, and I hope it is beautiful no matter where you are. And I hope you guys love more today than you did yesterday. Stay safe, be kind, and until next time, bye y'all.